Yo, so it looks like we got something to react to today, which is the new Belle Delphine video. And I'm not talking about an OnlyFans one, I'm talking about something she actually put on YouTube. I'm curious to react to this video for two reasons. One, it is a parody, I think, of Avril Lavigne's Skater Boy, which is something I absolutely loved when I was younger. And two, there was a little bit of controversy coming into this week with Belle Delphine and another creator, and I believe that creator's in this video, so I want to see if that controversy is in this video. Let's check it out. All right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> the the ridiculousness of it. Oh God! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I was not expecting that voice. Is it a chipmunk? There it is. Jesus. Okay. Oh, he got, dude, he got folded. <laughs> Holy shit, hold up, he got folded, bro. Oh. <laughs> no joke, he got folded, dude. It is pretty cheesy, but it's funny. <laughs> dude, how many? <gasps> Bro, dude. That looked like it hurt. She might have got out of the way right at the last second. <laughs> You gotta promote the only fans, right? <laughs> nice. This is, this is the best promo for her. The best promo for her OnlyFans, to be honest. I think Belle Delphine could really do a lot more than she's currently doing. Granted, I'm pretty sure she's making buku bucks already, but I do think she can genuinely do so much more and would get her even more buzz. Like, I'm surprised she hasn't done more collabs with other creators because I do think that there's an audience out there for her to grow even more than she already is. I said a bunch of these ideas when I watched her video a hundred times in a row. Also, I'm kind of shocked that she has a Facebook and even more surprised that she doesn't have a Twitch because I think she would kill it as a streamer. I did mention at the start of the video there was a little bit of controversy. It was over these photos right here because it did involve 2Med, who was the other creator in that video, in a Donkey Kong outfit. Now, a lot of people automatically jumped on the train of, oh, look, Belle Delphine's racist. She's making 2Med dress up as Donkey Kong. If you don't know the connection between why that would be racist, just look it up. There's plenty of stuff on the internet about it. So that was part of the controversy. It even sprouted out videos like this and people responding to this, like Nux Taku. Both 2Med and Belle Delphine are friends of mine, and Belle told me about this collab last Wednesday. There was obviously no racial intent. Videos like these are slanderous and exploitative. Honestly, I think it takes a professional racist to find racism in a skit like this. So that does come from Nux Talk, who's somebody that says that they do know Belle Delphine and 2Med. Personally, I don't really see any issue with this. I've been on the internet long enough to know that the internet will jump on anything that they can complain about. Because at the end of the day, if you can cause some controversy, it's all about the likes and views that you get with that. Honestly, it doesn't even really matter what you're saying half of the time. On top of that, a lot of people are going out there saying that the two creators smashed. And if they did, good for them. That's awesome. It's always nice when when people smash but at the end of the day it doesn't fucking matter because it's two adults doing what they want to do so yeah there's some stupid internet happenings for you if you like this content hit that subscribe button as always i'm your host juice box remember you wake up in the morning ask yourself something i'm a daily dose of juice see you guys next time